First on 5, News 5 investigates. A News 5 investigation has uncovered new details about a pregnant woman from Mobile County accused of ripping off adoptive couples. Devin Walsh broke this story last night and spent today looking deeper into the suspect's background. Well, Roseanne, Shereen Guernsey was in court today noticeably pregnant. Her baby is due in January. We have learned, though, this isn't the first time she's been in criminal court. She has a rap sheet that some of the adoption attorneys tell us many families were willing to overlook. Dressed in prison scrubs instead of maternity clothes, 32-year-old Shereen Guernsey learned she would not be getting out of jail, at least for now. A judge gave her no bond for violating her probation. News 5 has obtained Guernsey's lengthy rap sheet. You can see arrest after arrest. It is two pages long. There are arrests on here for resisting arrest, escape, and disorderly conduct. But most of the charges on here stem from a conviction for writing counterfeit checks totaling $20 $8,000 several years ago. News 5 pulled her mug shots. Starting in 2008 until this week, she's been booked 12 times. You can see she's had long hair, hair pulled back, and now short hair. There were kind of always some red flags and things that she did or said that just kind of made me think something was off. News 5 talked to a Pennsylvania couple who says they were promised Guernsey's baby. She told us the other day that she went to the doctor and the baby was five pounds. We are only using their first names, Beth and Rocky. They knew about her criminal record, but they were given a document by their adoption agency that somewhat eased their minds. It shows Guernsey gave up three children to adoption in the past, so they thought she would go through with this adoption too. You kind of have this love for them because of what they're giving you. Um, it's something I could not do myself. So she is offering her child to me. And how do you ever thank somebody for that? Mobile adoption attorney Richard Shield says there's no central database for couples to check if a birth mother is promising her baby to multiple families. They talk to her all the time. <laughs> I mean, so, and she was a very, very good con artist. She knew how to play them. She knew how to play their emotions and how to talk to them. Well, according to documents from one adoption agency, we also learned that Guernsey has two children with her ex-husband. So the baby expected to be born in January is her sixth child. Adoption attorneys tell us there are four families who sent Guernsey money. If she's found guilty, a judge can order her to pay them back. Mel.